Ladies and gentlemen, introducing our next 2009 California Wrestling Hall of Fame inductee, Mr. Richard Fox. His presenters are his three boys, Christian, Brandon, and Evan Fox. Rich was a graduate of Johnson High School and attended Sacramento City College in 1970 and 1974. He was 29 as a sophomore and finished second in the Valley Conference as well as fifth in the region. Rich then started his coaching career at Johnson High School and in just a few years, Rich has made his name as head coach of Ponderosa High School. While the head coach of Ponderosa High School, Rich teams were some of the best in the state. He won numerous conference subsection and section titles while the coach there. Let's listen to some of his accomplishments. Rich Fox stands among California's most accomplished wrestling coaches. While spending a majority of his 32-year coaching career at Ponderosa High School, he compiled a coaching record of 454 wins and 49 losses. His teams won 14 sectional dual meet titles, 13 subsection titles, and 8 Sac Joaquin section championships. This is the most championships won by any coach in the section. Rich was selected as the California State Wrestling Coach of the Year in 1997 and earned four Coach of the Year honors by the Sacramento Bee. His dedication and love for wrestling has been an influence on hundreds of young men, 37 of whom have gone on to coach wrestling at the middle school or high school level. Rich stepped down as a head coach a few years ago and is now coaches golf at Ponderosa High School. Moreover though, Rich can still be seen at all the major wrestling tournaments each year here in California. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, inducted into the 2009 California Wrestling Hall of Fame, Mr. Richard Fox. I've never been in a room with so many officials before. <laughs> I'm just lucky that I haven't been kicked out yet. Um, I truly like to apologize to all of them while I'm here for some of the bad things I might have said about you over the years. <laughs> I met most of them. I'd like to take this honor, also uh, this opportunity to uh, thank all those that uh, had anything to do with uh, me being inducted into this uh, California Hall of Fame, Wrestling Hall of Fame. Um, I'd like to, uh, a special thanks to, uh, to the brothers that I've had, uh, the six brothers that I grew up with that helped me in the sport of wrestling, that, that got me started in it, and and like to have a couple of them stand up in my family. My, uh, my wife and my uh, dear mother, who uh, put up with all the broken furniture in the, in the living room, did stand up. I've had the opportunity to have a, what you would consider a story, storybook career. Um, a career that I'm proud of and, and all the people that uh, helped me along the way all the coaches and, and uh, people that were there standing and, and helping me out uh, so much in the last uh, 32 years as I've, uh, as I've coached at Ponderosa High School, most of which I'm so proud of. And, and think of the, the wrestlers as, as my brothers, my sons, and, and uh, they just mean a lot to me, and, and, and a lot of them are here this evening. And, I don't want to mention all the names, but I'm so proud of them and, and uh, all the others that have had an opportunity to coach. And, and because of that, uh, I treated them like sons. I would like to apologize for the paddle that I used for, for all those years. I uh, hope I didn't leave too many scars um, along the way. Um, I, uh, just a couple of days ago, a young man called me up and thanked me for all the things that I helped him with in, in his life and in wrestling. And, and it got me thinking about, uh, I might have passed it on to others, but I, there's an individual that I'm so proud of that uh, being inducted this evening. That was a big reason that I went into coaching. Uh, and he passed it on down to me, Bill Hickey. One thing I can remember Bill always saying is we might not win the match, but it won't be because we're out of shape. <laughs> and I tried to instill that in, in the uh, wrestlers that I've coached over the last 32 years. And, and there's been so many of them that uh, it's been a, just a great honor to, to uh, be with. So I thank, uh, thank you, Bill, wherever you are out in the audience for, 
for what you instilled in me as a wrestling a wrestling coach and a, and a young man and, and being a positive role model and a mentor in my life. Um, he only had one thing going against him and that was when he coached in high school, he, he wore uh, blue and white. Uh, It seemed like it, uh, I had it all, great teams, great kids, great coaches to work with. And above all, having three sons along the way that were California State place winners themselves as my presenters this evening. And also, keep it in the family, my two daughters that, that helped along with the uh, stats as, as, as they were in high school also. As I've seen some of the, the old uh, Dogs here tonight, uh, all the, the old wrestling coaches that have helped to mold me along the way. I'm grateful to them. Um, I can recall as a very young wrestling coach, Larry Nelson was on the sidelines and I, uh, I was a little upset at the time and a little frisky and I got up and threw, not throw the chair, but I just kind of, well I did, I threw the chair. Okay. <laughs> He comes over and puts his arm around me. He says, son, if you're going to last in this sport, you're going to need to settle down. <laughs> and uh, I appreciate uh, Larry for giving, giving me that advice. Uh, some of the things that I'm, I'm most proud of is, like I said, being able to coach for that many years and to have my three sons that uh, I was able to coach. Uh, seeing uh, one of my uh, wrestlers become a Division I All-American. Uh, beating an Iowa Hawkeye to play seventh place in the nation. Forty of these kids came on to coach wrestling. They went on to coach wrestling at different levels. And uh, I think that's what uh, I'm so proud of, is, is probably the most proud of, is, is seeing all these young men go on and, and coach in wrestling. And, and uh, what the, I think uh, Rod Headland said it the uh, best a few years ago that uh, it, it's not the wins and losses in their life, but the men that they turn out to become. And I'm so proud of, uh, proud of all of them. And I thank, uh, I, um, I'm so grateful in my heart for, for my family, uh, for uh, my God, and for wrestling. That's been a big part of my life, and, and they haven't always been in that order as my wife would attest. But the older that I've got, I realize that family is most important in God in our life. And wrestling has is, is just been a, a big part of my life. And I thank you all for this great honor. Thank you. Once again, Mr. Richard Fox.